Okay, so if any of you don't follow me on Instagram, which you should, at Brianini, shameless plug, um, you wouldn't know that I have sold my car and I am buying a new one. So today is Saturday, it's a week on since I put down the deposit of my new car and sold my old car. Um, if you do have me on Instagram, you would have seen the emotional wreck that I was when I sold my car. I literally was like crying my eyes out. Um, <laughs> it's so silly, but I had my car since I was 17 and I literally loved it and I was literally so upset for it to go but now I've kind of got over it and I'm really excited to get my new car it's taken a lot longer than I thought it was going to and being carless for a week was been has been awful because I live in like an area where there's like you can't walk to anywhere you have to drive if you want to get anywhere so I've literally been having to rely on Dean for lifts and things like that so it's been literally a nightmare so we've just got up and we are going to go collect my new car i've got to pop home first and grab all the cash to buy it um, and then i'll be driving my new car home so i like curled my hair today and i'm not sure how i feel about it and i really burnt my finger really badly so clearly i need to get better at that um but yeah i'm not used to curling my hair because when my hair was super 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 long i would never ever curl it if it was ever curled it was like from braids or someone else had curl it, curled it for me or it took me honestly like hours and hours and hours so it was never like um a quick hairstyle for me but i've tried to curl it but i need some like help on how to make it just like wavy um my arm is aching so much i can't even be bothered to hold this camera up um we just went to the bank and got all the money out for my car which now i feel like i don't want to let go of like when you have like a large sum of money i'm like I don't want to give this away now but like i'm carrying it through town and i'm like every person that walks past me i'm like convinced they're about to rob me obviously they don't know that i have money in my bag but you know what you feel like when you've got like large sums of money on you i'm like they're definitely gonna rob me but yeah we're gonna drive to peterborough now which is like 40 minutes from us um to go collect my car and then i can drive it home and um, i'm quite nervous to drive it home just because it's so different to my old car like it's the exact same car pretty much but it's a different engine and a different it's diesel not petrol so it feels really really different but yeah i'm excited so i have my flat <laughs> i was out of breath because it's so cold so if any of you have beetles or you have anyone in your family that have beetles or you've just seen them you'll know that they always have flowers in them specifically gerberas now i had a red one in my beetle before obviously because bell was red now i've got a black beetle i can have any color that i want and i was like i really want pink and then i decided to call my car bumble um because i'm like obsessed with bees at the moment i don't really know why i'm just a little bit obsessed with bees at the moment that oh, alarm is really irritating so i decided to get black and then it arrived and it had a little bee on it which is so cute and then i was like i really want yellow so i ordered yellow as well and then i have a pink one and a bigger yellow one at home as well um we've just got to the car place now i just gave the guy a call but he's just with another person at the moment so in about 10 minutes we can pay for my car and drive my car home and i'm gonna put her little flowers in her vase because if you know like vw beetles come with the vase already like it's not like something you buy for the car it comes with the vase like right behind the steering wheel so i'm gonna pop these in there and it's gonna look super cute i literally cannot wait that alarm is doing my head in but then we need to find somewhere to eat because i'm so hungry i wanted breakfast for dinner last night so i said no let's do breakfast for breakfast today and then we forgot to do that as well so i really want to go and have like a late breakfast do you know what i'm craving what you know those paninis from costa with the mozzarella and um like pesto wait what you know those paninis from costa oh yeah with the mozzarella and the pesto should we make those she's so pretty we just got home from buying my car and i am so hungry we were supposed to have breakfast we didn't have breakfast and it's now half past three and we haven't eaten anything so we have made um you know those paninis from costa i don't know if any of you have these these are so good 
They're the pesto, tomato and mozzarella paninis from Costa. I literally love them. They're so good. I used to eat them all the time. Whenever I used to go out for a Costa day, I used to always, always, always have one. But they don't make them gluten-free now. So I went and got these, which are the Shah gluten-free panini rolls. And then Dean just had like normal panini rolls. And then we bought mozzarella, which obviously isn't dairy-free, but it's like low dairy. So it doesn't really irritate my skin at all. Obviously, I will try and cut it out completely, but dairy-free mozzarella is absolutely disgusting. And then we got some sugar drop tomatoes, which obviously, again, aren't particularly great for psoriasis. But like I've mentioned in previous vlogs and videos, because I am on Slara at the moment, I don't need to be 100% free from. So this is how it's going they're looking really good we've got mozzarella so this is dean's ones here with loads of mozzarella cut it in half and everything like they do it on a slanting costa mm. good Again. Do you want another one? Sit. Sit. Stay. Good girl. Paw. Please. Paw, please. Thank you, Paw, please. Paw, please. Good girl. She she's lovely when she's eating. You loving your Dini? Oh, look at her. You get better treatment than everyone does, Mabel. We get cuddles and food. <gasps> Where's he gone? Where's Dini gone? Mabel! <whistles> Mabel! She does not care because she's got food now. Okay, I'll leave you to eat your biscuit. Bye, Mabs. Bye bye. <laughs> Love you. Are you cold? I'm so cold. <laughs> this weather's BS. No, Mabel, come back! Come back! Mabel, come back! Mabel, what's this? Mabel, what's this? Mabel, what's this? Ah, uh, good girl, you love me more. It's because I've just given you loads of treats, isn't it? A bony owl and lots of like shape things. Oh, yeah. Is it nice, Mabes? Is it cute? Oh, you're so pretty. You have to look into the camera and smile. Mabel, Mabel. No, bye, bye. Literally in love with my new car. Good morning, Mabel. Now you. You can't see your bloody face. She's too cosy. So I've literally just woken up, got no makeup on, hence why I look so pale and awful. Um, but it is obviously the next day now. Um, we literally just had dinner, chilled, and then just went to sleep quite early actually. We were both quite tired because we got up quite early to go and get the car and everything. Um, so I'm just going to make us breakfast now. And I'm going to make Dean a coffee, but he can't decide whether he wants hot coffee or iced coffee. The struggles of having coffee made for you in the morning. So Dean left his cereal that he bought at my house, so we're having to drive back to my house now. And I haven't used the convertible roof in my car yet. <laughs> so it's literally like minus, I haven't got my car key. <laughs> literally like minus one today. And we're gonna put the roof down on my car. Got my hat on. Got my car key. Found it. <laughs> That Makaki. She is so pretty. Oh wait, you have to put this back. What you <laughs> I am so in love with Bumble. Bumble's got her flowers in. I'll go get your beat. Yeah. What a 
and that looks so cool. Okay, so we've just spent the day pretty much just planning where we're going to go travelling, writing down lists of countries that we want to go to and kind of things that we want to do there. We've got so many places we want to go. Now it's just to decide where we kind of go first and what we want to do when we go to those places. So we've kind of got everything down that we definitely want to do. So it's just deciding what to do in what order. But I'm kind of just going to let that happen however it happens. But yeah. I'm like super tired now so we've just come to bed for like a little bit of a lay down I'm just gonna end this vlog here um, it's been a bit of a random one probably not very exciting but I want to get more into vlogging but whilst we're just at home we're not really doing anything exciting and there's not really much to do in England especially when it's really cold at the weekends but if you did like this video give this video a thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe to my channel and I'll catch you in my next video